All right. We are live. And we got Radical Red. And I think we can PB today, guys. I think we are ready to break our PB. I mean, of course, it's our PB on this update because this is our first attempt on this update. But just in general in Radical Red, we absolutely can PB today. So let's get it done. The next fight we got coming up is Brendan right before the Safari Zone. I feel pretty... I feel pretty good about this. I just went ahead off screen and did some calcing and stuff, and I think we, I think we're good. Um, I think we're in pretty good shape. We got a pretty good team here. Um, I should be able to honestly just lead with Hisuian Typhlosion with fur coat against his Metagross and just flamethrower one shot him. Um, yeah, and then from there on out, we've got save switch-ins for every Mon. So, barring any, you know, any random crits or any unforeseen circumstances, we should be in pretty good shape. The dogs are wrestling behind me, so I apologize for that. But, actually, we can, let's at least check our encounters here before we, before we do this. Good Rod Rosalia, Good Rod Milotic, Super Rod Tornadus, or Tyrant. Okay, good Mons, but not anything that's going to make a difference in this fight. So let's just go ahead. We'll get that after. I think we just dive on in. I think we just dive on in. I think we are absolutely ready to uh, wipe the floor with Brendan. All right, let's do it. Let's get some hype in the chat. Let's get going. Here he is. Okay. All right, Brendan. Should lead with Metagross with an air balloon. Okay, right off the bat, I just flamethrower and he dies. Perfect. Elephant still says that his air balloon popped even though he literally died. Okay, Sceptile. We this is a safe switch in for Satitan. No matter what he does, I live. Even if he SDs, I Oko with Ice Shard. So if he SDs, we're okay. But I should take any hit that he tries to land on us. It's probably an EQ. Which is which would be good because it's not stab. Okay, he does SD. That would be absolutely terrifying if I didn't have Ice Shard, but I just click Ice Shard. This should kill all day, every day. Twice on a Wednesday. Okay, Gardevoir comes in. Probably Focus Blast. Okay, he gets my Storm Drain. Which is fine, because we're just going to go Genesect. He does land the Focus Blast. Unfortunate, but we should take it pretty well. And now I just Magnet Bomb. This should kill every time. Perfect. Okay, Metacham comes in. He is Choice Scarf, so he's going to outspeed everything I've got. But I just go to... Go to Giratina. <laughs> he CCs. That's perfect because he's Choice, so now he cannot hit me. Which means he might switch here. He might have to switch. Since he's locked in, I'm going to predict that he swaps to... Well, it'll be either Crawdon or Xbot. Either way, I Aura Sphere because... He... No, he just stays in. Really? Okay. So now I Shadow Sneak. 
He has the CC, which he can't touch me with. Wow, he's throwing. He's throwing so hard. Now he withdraws. Now he goes x -Bloud. Okay, that's fine. Because now he's going to Shadow Ball. And I go... Let's see, I think I go Como-O here. Yeah, I think I go Como-O. He does Shadow Ball, but I take it. Take it really well, actually. Now I just... Sky Uppercut. Good chance to kill, not guaranteed, though. Yeah, not quite. Boom Burst, I should take it. Pop my citrus. He does not have any priority. I just drain punch. Not gonna matter. A little extra health though. Metacham comes back in. He's probably gonna psycho cut here. Either way, I just go to Giratina. He could ice punch, he could ice punch, but that's fine. I got solid rock. He does ice punch. Totally fine. I take this really well. I just shadow sneak. Metacham goes down. Trodon is all that remains, and he is banded. I'm predicting a crunch here. Crunch makes the most sense for him. I could honestly just stay in. Yeah, I think I just stay in and... Well, first turn I protect. I'll scout. See what he gets locked into. He does get locked into Crunch. Okay. I am gonna... I am gonna swap then. Actually, you know what? I definitely take one no matter what. I'm gonna Aura Sphere. There's the Crunch. That does hit pretty hard. So now this is where I go Urshifu. Crunches, I resist. No defense drop. I just drain punch and I win. Perfect. Easiest fight of my life. It's actually the easiest fight of my life. Deathless Safari Zone Brandon. Okay, we got uh, we got Rock Smash. Got more expert belts. That's awesome. More lefties. Okay. Damp rocks. Icy rocks. Grass seeds. Heart scales. King's rocks. Let's see berries. Metal powders. PP maxes, let's go. Yo, this guy teaches substitute. I need to remember that. That's big. Rhydon or Rhyhorn? Uh, 
I'll worry about that later. Okay, so I can't do Koga till I rematch gym leaders, which I expected, that's fine. Okay, we got the Super Rod. Now we did save an encounter south of Lavender for this. Okay, nighttime. Super Rod Tornadus, that would be awesome. I'm okay with a Tornadus or a Tyrant, honestly. Do I have anything? Anything that can learn T Wave? Thunderbolt. Thunder Wave. Roselia with a super rod. Wait, I thought that was a good rod encounter. I didn't use my good rod, did I? Did I just throw? I swear I used my super rod. Hold on. I used my super rod. I went back and watched the footage. I used my super rod. Why did it give me a Roselia? Uh, no. Uh, that's not... Yeah, that doesn't count. That literally lied to me. It's only level 25. There's no way I can... Let's freaking get it. Oh, let's go. Okay. I do have to release the Roselia since it didn't count. Which is just stupid. But that was even a thing. Toxic chain. Hey! Reese, quit it. have a 30% chance of badly poisoning. That's not bad. Does he get more than one ability? Tornadus. 
he does. Iron barbs. That ain't bad. I mean, neither one's a bad ability. Okay, we also have an encounter south of Lavender, I believe, that we can get. That's a good mon, dude. What are his attacks like? Both really good. A little bit better special attacker. Ooh. Yo, Wide Lens Bleak Storm? up sir mike long time no see how's the death box looking it's a little full I'm not gonna lie to you it's it's a little full but you know we're uh we're on the verge of a pb today so that's really good okay i do believe we have an encounter here that we can get Route 12. Uh, let me double check Garchomp and Senescorch. Make sure I didn't get them. I know I've had one at some point, but I don't think it was here. Route 21. And Vermilion City. And I'm where? Route 12. Okay. So, let me check daytime first. Any huge power pure power mons. Uh, the only one that I've seen so far is a mega all creamy. So yes, but not it's not very useful. Uh Garchomp. Garchomp's the common one with super rod. We could get a Garchomp back. Because dupes is optional. I think that's the play, guys. I think we uh, just go after another Garchomp. Honestly. Full send on Landshark. Let's do it. Yeah. Since we, like, we've had one already, but it's it's a good mon. And again, dupes is optional. Okay, let me just re-verify. Garchomp. Super Rod. Only Super Rod. Okay. I can't Thunder Wave it, unfortunately. Do I have a Mon? Hmm. Anything that could put it to sleep? Does Lilligant get, like, sleep powder? Can you yawn? That's what I'm wondering. I might have something with yawn. I do get sleep powder on Lilligant. Uh, I'll do that over Victory Dance for now. Okay, re-verify. Garchomp. Super Odd. Only Super Odd. go super rod first you've ever gotten in rad red uh not quite okay we do get the guard chomp awesome okay i'm gonna quick ball first 
We don't even need sleep powder. First ball. Let's get it. Let's absolutely get it. Tablets of Ruin Garchomp. I did put that in the dock, right? Pretty sure I wrote that down. Tablets of Ruin and Shed Skin. Yep. Perfect. That's what I like. Thanks for three likes on the stream, guys. Okay. Lowers the attack of all other Pokemon by 25%. That could be really big for the uh, Brock rematch. Honestly. To be honest, chat. Got the Megastone for Garch. I don't think so. I can go check that, though. I don't think I do. If I do, it'll be right here. Nah, I got Garboder and Gardevoir. I don't have Garchomp yet. Uh, let's get this bad Larry up the level. EQ, absolutely. Get rid of Dig for that. Perfect. Okay. Now we strategize for Brock. I think Brock is probably who we want to take on first. Okay, he is going to have the sand up. It's permanent sand. Unless I change it, of course. Yeah, after beating Geo 3 with Lance. Oh, shoot. So we still got a while. I have, I've never done that fight. If I can, okay, so my PB, I beat the Brock rematch and the Misty rematch, and then I was in the Surge rematch, and that's when I lost. So I'm just a couple battles away from my PB. So, fingers crossed we can, we can pull it off today. Um, I wonder what my win con is here. Arcanine is sashed. So sweeping is going to be tough. Do I have like a primordial Seamon that I can send in right off the bat to get rid of that sand? Uh, I have a Hoopa. Hoopa will get bodied by knockoff though. The Dene died, I think. Ampharos died, Vanillux died, I have Avalug, but Avalug is going to get destroyed by close combat. Can you set up spikes or stones? Um, I don't know if I have a stealth rockmon or not. The Protosynthesis with Booster Energy buffs their attack, right? I think is what it does. This isn't a double battle, correct? Acquired for Koga except Erica. Okay. So we don't have to rematch Erica, but we do have to rematch the other three. Or if we do Misty first, we get a... She gives us a randomized Palafin. Okay, this this could be tough. I need to I need to strat here. Um, he's probably going to want to Stealth Rock me turn one, I'm guessing. I think that's what he's going to want to do. Is there any shot I can Oko him before he can get the rocks off? Magic Bounce? I don't think I have Magic Bounce, unfortunately. Ground and Fighting. So no quad weaknesses. He's weak to water. He's weak to ice. Urshifu here. Ooh, I'm going to have to go up in speed for that Arcanine. I was going to say his Arcanine sashed. It's a Hisuian Arcanine. Um, but I do have... Surging Strikes I can take him out with. As long as he doesn't Okomi with Wild Charge. 
He does have E-Speed. If he can Wild Charge E-Speed me, I could be in trouble there. That's gonna, that's gonna be uh, a little dicey. Okay, one Mon at a time. One Mon at a time. I've got to lead with a special attacker on this Great Tusk. Are you special or physical? You're physical. Okay. You do have Water Bubble, though. Let me level you up. Do you have any decent Water-type moves? I did get Liquidation, didn't I? I think I got Liquidation. Ficious Rend? If the user moves before the target, the power of this move is doubled. Okay, let's explore that. Okay, what's our speed stat here? 120. That's down in speed nature, though. I don't think we pull it off. Uh, go Jolly. I don't outspeed, so he is going to get the rocks off. Kind of unfortunate. Um, what about Rillaboom? He is sort of ruin. What if I run a jolly Rillaboom? I know he's a physical attacker. I outspeed by one point. Boost the Pokemon's most proficient stat. So it could be attack or defense. Oh, man. Okay, if I go... Little boom. Little 68. Sort of ruin. Jolly. Holding a miracle seed. With Razor Leaf. Not even close. It's a two shot at best. Mm. Is there uh, an option to click like activating his protosynthesis? I think I could one shot with fur coat Typhlosion, could I? Hisuian Typhlosion? Knock off the sash and go for it. Um, it's not, uh, so right now I'm calking for Great Tusk. He doesn't have a sash. He's got the booster energy and Protosynthesis. I think the play for, um, Arcanine, if I can tank it, is gonna be Surging Strikes or Shifu. Uh, what was I doing here? What was I calking? Uh, Typhlosion. So, Typhlosion, Suya in level 68. I outspeed all day, every day. My ability is Fur Coat. Ooh, Headlong Rush could still kill. That's a roll. Extra Sensory. What if I make my nature modest? I'm holding an Expert Belt. Still don't kill. Dang. Oh, man. What about all creamy?
Oh. Okay, so he does have speed. What if I went... It's a speed tie with Timid. I do one shot with Moonblast, but even if I Mega and I'm Timid, it's a speed tie. Oh! Do I have a Choice Scarf? What up, Uni? How's it going? don't have a choice scarf. Dang it! Man, that's so close. If I had one more point in speed, that could be the play. Wait, what about Tornadus? Could Tornadus that's right in front of me just be the play? This is a fighting type. Tornadus, level 68. I outspeed easy. Uh, if I run him modest with, will Air Slash do it? Air Slash does it. Oh, yeah. Okay, I think that's my lead. Oh, wait, my ability's Iron Barbs. Make sure I got that in there. Could run a sharp beak as well. I shouldn't need to. Okay, it says even with the sand up. I thought sand boosted. I thought sand boosted uh, ground types. Special defense. Of rock type Pokemon. Okay. So not ground type, so we're good on Great Tusk. Okay, perfect. Alright. Let's go ahead, let's clean out our box, get a fresh start. It's going good, how's the run? We're still alive. We could get our PB today. We're only a couple battles away from from getting a PB, so that's really nice. I'm not going to lie, the Arcanine scares me just a little bit, just because I'm going to need a clean swap in. For Urshifu, because that wild charge scares the daylights out of me. Unless I went with a ground move. He's quad weak to ground, too. Okay, so Tornadus, we're gonna make... Does he have to be modest? Or can he be, like... Lax? He could be Lax. Do you have any special attackers? Yeah, Amastar. But this thing's not going to be fighting Amastar. Oh, and Blood Moon Ursaluna. Shouldn't be fighting Blood Moon Ursaluna either, though. Actually, let me go modest with a citrus berry. On the off chance he does something happens and he does land a hit on me, he shouldn't be able to. Make sure none of these berries they gave me are uh, also for eight HP. Warren. 
Citrus. Okay, so it's just citrus. Okay, modest nature. Iron barbs. Air slash. Should kill. I outspeed all day long. Okay. Alright. Tyranitar. <sighs> Definitely want a fighting type. Definitely want a fighting type. Oh man, I wish. I wish I could get rid of the sandstorm. Any neutralizing gas? I don't believe so. Pretty sure I don't have any neutralizing gas. Oh, I wish it was my my physical defense that was so pumped up on hit one Lee. I could go Urshifu here. <laughs> yeah, let's calc this. Okay, so Tyranitar, Leader Brock. Okay, the sand up. I go Urshifu, Rapid Strike, Blank Set, level 68. That'd help with Blood Moon. That would be, yeah. That definitely would. Okay, right now I'm Impish. Do I need to be Impish? I don't think so. I think I can be Adamant. Yeah, so I can be Adamant and still outspeed. My ability is Supreme Overlord, which hopefully doesn't come into play at all. Um... If I Drain Punch... Oh, Drain Punch kills all day, every day. All day, every day. Surging Strikes also has a good chance to kill. I don't think Power Up Punch will kill in one. No, it won't. the weight. I am going to run him jolly because if on the switching, if he D dances, he would be faster than me if I'm not jolly. So I'm going to go jolly and drain punch will still kill. Surging strikes back on him. Over power up punch. Okay, yeah, so even if he D dances, I outspeed by one point. Which is super risky. I don't love that. But, you know, we roll with it. Arcanine, Leader Brock. So I do outspeed. Oh, Wild Charge only does 52%. Eh. Okay. Does have Rockhead, Focus Sash. Surging Strikes gets rid of his Sash. I outspeed. So even if I have to take a s switch in. Okay, perfect. Okay. This Urshifu is huge for this fight then. Okay, Amistar. This one has weak armor, so it does not have Swift Swim or anything. It doesn't look like it's going to set up rain. It could Shell Smash, which would be unfortunate. 
It's got weak armor, power herb. I really need to one-shot this thing. And I think the mon to do it is gonna be... Who has higher spadef? Rillaboom at 121. Or Lilligant at 128. Okay. Kalki time. This scares me a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. Um, Lilligant, Hisuian. Level 68, and Ice Beam would do 73%. Um, I am Jolly currently. And if he Shell Smashes, I'm gonna... Ooh, if he Shell Smashes, actually, I just lose. Um. Ooh. So if he Shell Smashes, he's plus two special attack. Oh, and then an Ice Beam would kill. I don't love that without a Focus Sash, and I don't think I have one. Yeah. Ah, no Focus Sash. Dang it! Can you haze to cancel his Shell Smash? The thing is, I'm worried about him Shell Smashing because I, I, it's uh, set mode. I don't know who's coming in. So he comes in, and then I have to do a hard swap. And if he shell smashes that turn, it doesn't matter. He's going to outspeed almost anything I've got. Unless I have something that's 215 speed or better. Which I might. Potentially. I don't. No, that Lilligan. There's no way, right? Yeah, 184. Yeah, I probably don't have anything quite that fast. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. If he was gonna go meteor beam or surf turn one, I think I'm chilling because I think a leaf blade just takes him out straight up. Yeah, Leaf Blade does Drain Punch. I don't think would. Yeah, Drain Punch doesn't quite do it, but Leaf Blade would. Um, actually, what about Brute Bonnet? I know he's slow. He's tanky, though. Can he tank an Ice Beam at plus two? There's no way, right? There's no way, right? Ah, it's a roll. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gotcha, just trying to help. Yeah, no, no, I, I appreciate any help. I, I'm definitely, I will listen to any, any tips and stuff. Ah, if he meteor beams Arctivish, I'd be in trouble. Um, Flapple gets bodied by Ice Beam. There's no way I outspeed if he smashes. If he smashes with the shells. How fast is Cartana? Oh, not fast enough. Dang it! <laughs> Although... Cartana... Oh, yeah, no, I just die. I just died at everything. Everything kills me. Everything sucks. Wait, I have Ice Skills Harry Emma. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Harry Emma, level 68. Ability is Ice Scales. Ah, okay, so even after a Shell Smash, I can take two hits. So, if I go... Fake out's not gonna do anything, but might as well just get just a little bit. Force palm. Force palm's a two shot, unless I'm not even at it. It's still a two shot. Okay. 
This could be the play, though. Then if he shell smashes and he's plus two, well, that put him minus one defense as well, because he has a power herb, not a white herb. So I could fake out to get hit for 42%. I fake out, turn one. This might work. Just might work. What's up, Michaela? How's it going? Fake out Drain Punch on Harry Emma. Yeah, maybe would Drain Punch do better? Yeah, Drain Punch. Drain Punch probably would be the play. He does get it, right? He should. Yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna... I can get rid of Force Palm. If I'm running Drain Punch, and I Vacuum Wave for priority. If I need just a little bit of extra oomph, you know? Yeah, so if I fake out Drain Punch, I'm chilling. And that's if he Shell Smashes. That's... I'm safe on a shell smash. So this thing absolutely covers Amistar. Okay, so I give him a citrus berry just for a rainy day. I think that takes care of Amistar. Uh, Blood Moon Ursa Luna, this one's gonna be fun. So you got priority on Vacuum Wave. Yeah, I shouldn't need it. Uh, a Fake Out into a Drain Punch should take it. Drain Punch alone is close. But where Fake Out has to be turn one, I might as well get those chippies off, you know? <sighs> Blood Moon Ursa Luna. He's got Earth Power, Blood Moon, Vacuum Wave, Hyper Voice. I really want to hit him specially. I'm a mixed attacker. Right, I would have to run Modest. Do you get any special moves that'd be super effective? I know it's a long shot with Aegislash, but I at least want to explore the option. What if I went Hidden Power? Uh, do you have all your encounters, money chance? I th uh, except for the Safari Zone. We could do the Safari Zone first, I guess. Which might not be a bad idea. Idea. I can't spell. Ursa, Luna, Blood Moon, Leader Brock. In the sand. We got Age Slash, Shield Form. Level 68. I run him. Modest. Hidden Power. Ice? Not even close. No shot. There's no shot. This pans out. Wait a minute. You know what? You know what might be the play for that thing? Um. Giratina. Race, quit barking. Sorry about that, guys.
Homo O could potentially maybe sort of be an option too, because he is tanky. Let's look at Giratina. Solid Rock Giratina. 68. Ability Solid Rock. I outspeed all day, every day, twice on Tuesdays. What does Scrappy do? Hit ghost type Pokemon with damage dealing normal if I Ow! Glad I looked that up. Um Okay, so if I went like Aura Sphere. And I'm modest. Ooh. So if I'm modest, um, I can two-shot with Aura Sphere. He can't use Blood Moon twice in a row. He does have Vacuum Wave, which is priority, but that doesn't scare me. And I have Shadow Sneak. Which doesn't hit him, I'm an idiot. I don't get any other kind of priority, right? That's not super effective. God, I don't get Ice Beam or anything. I do get energy ball. It shouldn't matter. Orisville, Aura Sphere should kill regardless. What's up, Sea King? Welcome in. Could protect and bait the Blood Moon and Aura Sphere. Yeah, could do that too. Could do that too. Okay, yeah, this should this should work. Oh, he has lefties though. He has lefties, so I probably do want to go energy ball, get that a little extra, just a tiny bit more damage than Aura Sphere. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna need Dragon Claw for this at all, right? I'm not. Okay, I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna get rid of Dragon Claw. I'm gonna keep um shadow sneak in case i need it for someone else if i get caught in a sticky situation and i really need priority um lefties yeah i can run protect lefties on him it'd be okay okay so that should handle blood moon or saluna now he's got an aerodactyl a mega aerodactyl. I'm not outspeeding this thing. It does not matter what I do. I'm not even gonna try to. Aerodactyl mega leader Brock in the sand. Okay. Dual wing beat, earthquake, stone edge, dragon dance. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. 
Hey, Kenzie. How's it going? You add Rillaboom to the team? Ah, uh, not for dual wing beat. Dual wing beat would take out Rillaboom super easy. Stone Edge takes out Satitan. Even with Fur Coat, Stone Edge probably takes out Typhlosion. Dual wing beat destroys Lilligant. Rillaboom is a grass type. Yeah, that's not really the point. He would get bodied by Mega Aerodactyl. Use quite effective on Agron. What about Tablets of Ruin Garchomp? That could be a play. Oh, I hope he doesn't D dance though. If he D-dances, that could get real messy real quick. Shot him a dual chop. Octillery, then. I don't know if Octillery has the firepower for that. What's Octillery's ability? Where is he? Anger Shell. Any chance I one shot with that? We can look into this. I'll I'll humor you. Look into it. No, if he dual wink, yeah, he gets me below half. Of course, then I have a citrus. Gets me down to twenty nine. Yeah, that's not. No, Octillery's not going to cut it. He dies too easy. Any Megas by chance will get ability to cover Mega Arrow. The only Megas that I've been able to actually get so far are All Creamy and Sableye. What did Sableye have? Vessel of Ruin. Yeah, that's... That ain't going to cut it. Um... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, honestly, Garchomp might be my best bet. Because if he D dances. He dances it up on a Garchomp. Tablets of Ruin. Adamant. Have anything better than dual chop? A hey, yo toxic stall? <laughs> I'm not doing that. Um Wait, what about Iron Head? Ugh, not quite. So, uh... Iron Head does do more, though, than Dual Chop. I suppose Rock Tomb. 
Rock Tomb would be a two shot. He gets Liquidation? Liquidation should be the same as Iron Head. Slightly more, actually. Could lower defense, too. It's Menace. Menace. Yo, what's up, Nikki Poo? How do you do? Iron Tail is good, but just not accurate enough for me to feel comfy cozy using it. Rock Slide ain't gonna cut it. I think Liquidation's the way to go. I don't get any priority on him, I don't think. Can't hit him with Bulldoze. I don't think I get any priority on Garchomp. Okay, so I make Garchomp adamant. Actually, I have a day off today. Hell yeah. Very nice, man. Adamant. Tablets of Ruin. Even with the D dance, I take a hit pretty well. I can liquidation. Yeah, okay. And I think I just give him lefties. What's Sal Salamence and Agron's? Uh, give me just a sec. Yeah, the problem is Salamence. Uh, Agron's gonna get bodied by EQ, Salamence is gonna get bodied by Stone Edge. So, Friend Guard and Sandvale. Sandvale, if I got super lucky, could be nice because we are in a sandstorm, but it's Salamence isn't taking out the Aerodactyl. Um, okay, so that should cover his team with what I've got, but I have one slot left, so I just need one just good all-around Mon, kind of a security blanket. Um, Haxorus should outspeed most of his team. Which it looks like he does... I probably want someone with, with uh, some priority, though, huh? I'll bring one of my coma O. Oh. That sounds like a good security blanket. Let's make him... Wait, hold up. Do you learn any priority? You get Vacuum Wave. You do! Ha ha! I'm not gonna be using Dragon Claw. Dragon Claw's not super effective on anything here. Okay. And I'm going to make you... Um... I think I make you jolly. That's still not bad special attack. See, so I have another ability that's better than no guard. Merciless. I don't think that comes into play here. I think that's for, like, poisoned enemies. Have Vacuum Wave. Priority. Citrus Berry. Sure. I outspeed most of the team. Okay. I think that's our team, guys. 
Tyler, awesome news. I finally got shinies and chino nut last night. Heck yeah, Michaela. Very nice. Good stuff. Good job. Okay. Um, I am going to go pee real quick. And I will be right back and we will fight Brock. See you in a minute. Okay, ladies and gents, I'm back. Thank you for eight likes. <sighs> okay. Modest, jolly, aqua jet, surgery, strength, strain, punch. Wait, Harry Emma was for Amistar, right? So we want to go in If we go up in Spadef further with adamant okay glad I checked that okay we brought Giratina modest for blood moon or Saluna Archomp, Aerodactyl, Adamant, Lefties, Table to Ruin, Liquidation, and Iron Head, Como O, Jolly. Okay. All right, let's do this.
Okay, no speed up. We're gonna be smart here. Okay, great tusk comes in like he should. Okay, increases his attack. I just air slash. He withdraws. Okay. This could be a Stone Edge or a D dance. Stone edges me, that's fine. It's very okay, actually. So I'm gonna liquidation. There's the D dance, okay. The defense drop, man, I wish I had priority. Really wish I had priority. Dual wing beat, we should take. Oh, yeah. Quite well. Okay, Aerodactyl down. Goes back to Great Tusk. Probably gonna CC. He does set up rocks. That sucks. That really sucks. I'm just gonna air slash. He does withdraw. I should have seen it coming. Tyranitar comes in. I have to go for Shifu here. Stone edges, that's okay. I expected that. Should get it all back with Drain Punch though. Perfect. Probably gonna be Amistar. It's Ursaluna. Okay, so I'm gonna go Giratina. He goes Blood Moon. That kind of bites. He can't do that twice in a row, though. So I energy ball. I energy ball again. He goes down. Okay. <clears throat> Giratina's job is done. Arcanine comes in. <sighs> okay, this is Urshifu.
goes head smash. That's way better than wild charge. I'm perfectly okay with it. So 158 speed. Do I outspeed? I do. He could e-speed me, but I'm well out of range for that. So I just surging strikes. And Arcanine goes down. All that's left is on the star Great Tusk. There's my berry. Beautiful. Okay, Great Tusk comes in. I'm going to calc this because I might be able to just stay in. I cannot kill here. Tornadus. Does CC. It's going to be close. I do live. Problem is, he is going to swap here. I bet you anything he swaps here into Amistar. I have to air slash anyway. He doesn't swap, really. Okay. Is, did he just give up? Okay, on the star, I just go Hariyama. He's probably gonna Meteor Beam, which I'm totally okay with. Oh, he Shell Smashes, that's fine too. We calc this at plus two. So we fake out. Oh, he's got weak armor. Okay, just raises his speed. That's fine. I don't give two craps about speed. I'm a Hariyama. I'm slower than dirt. That's fine. Now I just drain punch. He surfs. I take it because I have ice scales. And I'm just a beast. A 
Let's go! Deathless Brock rematch. Whew. Feels good, man. Feels real good, man. Got the Aerodactylite and Stone Edge TM. Okay. Next up, we do have Misty rematch. We do. We could do Safari Zone first, though. Ugh. Her team is kind of stinky. I don't really like her team. Ugh. Ugh. Stinky, stinky, stinky. Oh, hi, Peanut. I was like, I swear I just heard a dog underneath me. Um, so it's going to be raining. Dude, I need a Mon with Desolate Land. If I got a Desolate Land Mon... Sheesh. All right, let's do Safari Zone. Let's get that encounter. We might get something really nice. What about Palmont? Or a dino. I could get a Hydreigon. Hydra Hydreigon doesn't really help me here. Oh, I wish I knew what abilities were going to be. I have to go Hydreigon over Palmont. I have to. Oh, let's go. Could get Swirl, get his Mega. Yeah. I feel like Hydreigon all around was my best option. Well, and... Squirtle was also a Surf encounter, which I don't have Surf till after Koga. So... Okay, hi Dragon, what have you got, buddy? Sword of Ruin. Okay. That is not bad. What is Fickle Beam? This move has a chance to deal double damage. That's it? That's just, that's the whole, there's no catch. Uh, okay. Ability pill has no effect. What about a dream patch? No, okay. So just sort of ruin, which is fine. That's totally fine. 
it doesn't jive real well with him as a mon. I mean, he's still got 105 attack. The special attack is better, but that's that's totally fine. He's a little bulkier than I gave him credit for. For some reason, I was thinking he was like super squishy. Okay. I'm satisfied with it. That's Hydrapple's move? Oh, okay. Sweet. Like, if that's the whole thing and there's no catch to it, it looks like a pretty good move. Okay, got a Leaf Stone... We'll probably go through Safari Zone two or three times. Earth Power. That's nice. I will probably go through here two, three times. Make sure we got all the items, all the Mega Stones. Don't have a Heracross, unfortunately. Rising Voltage. Doubles its power on electric terrain. I don't suppose Al Creamy could learn that. I doubt it. B drill. I, I do have a B drill. Okay, that's three megas we have. They're some of the worst megas ever, but you know they're megas. Dragon Pulse, I'll take that. Pidgeot, I, I don't think we have a Pidgeot. Got the gold teeth. Got Surf. Got Aura Sphere. That's potentially really big. What do I mean potentially? That's a great move. Maybe we got everything we want. Expanding force. Oh wait, is there not a step limit now? Did they update that? Hey yo? Hey yo? Oh, that's freaking sweet. a nice little quality of life feature they added. I feel like I heard there was a mole trace encounter in here somewhere. I have a hard time telling where I've been and where I haven't. We went down here, right? Maybe you need Surf to get to it, though. That's entirely possible. Dude, that's so nice that they added that.
Caught a chancy. Wow. A chancy. Cool. Okay, um, I think we're caught up on encounters. Actually, wait, maybe not. Maybe not quite. We might have another encounter or two we can get over here. Route 15. See what's up here first. Ooh. I need to remember this guy's here. Toxic orb. Flame orb. Awesome. Give the warden his gold teeth. Ah, yeah, good call. Good call. Alright, we'll do it. We'll we'll play the game. There's more to the game than just battling. I know, I know. It's this one. Okay, we got strength. For a rare candy, because it's not like we can't get any of those. Did they buff strength? I know they buffed a lot of... Nope. That's fine. Still Route 15? It is. Okay. Daytime encounters. Ooh, Tapu Lele. Nighttime. Still thinking Tapu Lele. Where, oh where, have I put my... Oh, what's his name? This guy, Genesect. Tapu Orlando are best options, yeah. I would agree with that. I think the Tapu Lele is better for me right now. Because of the typing. I don't really have a great psychic or fairy type currently, so... Oh! And he quick balls it up! And he quick balls it up! Arena trap. Please tell me you get more than one ability. You do. Okay. Whew. Dream patch. Intimidate. Intimidate actually isn't bad. Tapu Lele. Intimidate Arena Trap. Actually, Arena Trap. Arena Trap could be good too. For, uh, for fighting a trainer, we don't want to switch out. Um, you're 
You're not a mandatory trainer, are you? You might be. We're not in the sun or the snow route. I don't trust this. I'm gonna be honest, I don't trust this. I don't think I'm gonna go after that encounter. And not, not unless we something bad happens and we get like super desperate for another one. Hey, thanks Chris, appreciate you man. Tapu Lele been going for that in DAs, heck yeah. Hope you get it soon. Actually, what am I doing? Tapu Lele can't learn Expanding Force? Or does it already know it? Really? Interesting. Okay. Let's give you a Psychic then, I guess. Yeah, it's calking time. Did you do the Megastone cheat? What Megastone cheat? I didn't know there was a Megastone cheat. Uh, how many of these are physical attackers? been going for Tapu Lele and DAs for months hasn't shinied. Uh, sucks, Michaela. I'm sorry. I hope you get it soon. Tapu Lele, level 68 ability. Let's go. Let's go Arena Trap for the Calcs. I might run Arena Trap so they can't swap out. Because I know this Palafin is going to want to swap out. Can't run 
you timid. I'm gonna wanna run you modest. I think really that fast? Wow. Wave crash is pretty fast. Er, hits hard. What's up, Adarsh? Will you name Pokemon? Um, if I go Arena Trap, then she can't swap out and get Hero Form Palafin. And still flip turn actually dang it okay well never mind then if that's the case we run intimidate all the way what's up fox beast king how you doing thanks Michaela who's your favorite Pokemon probably Tyranitar I would say Expert Belt Tapu Lele? Problem is, it probably she probably is gonna flip turn turn one. She's gonna want to have Hero Form Palafin come in. Fox Beast King, thank you for subscribing, dude. Switching the active battling Pokemon or by using exclusive flip turn. It will transform. Okay, so just from switching out, that's it. Okay, so it absolutely is going to flip turn. Turn one. I just don't know what it's going to flip turn into. What is it going to flip turn into? Hang on, Water Compaction Brute Bonnet could actually be huge here. Thank you guys for 3,240 subscribers. I appreciate you. Okay. Okay, so Brute Bonnet. Level 68. With Water Compaction. I have Spore. I have Leaf Blade. Ugh. 
Okay, so do I want to run lefties or do I want to run an ice berry? You know what? I think I run Sunny Day on... on Taco. Ice Beam will only do 35% to me. Hurricane will do more than that, but Sunny Day will be up, so Hurricane shouldn't be super accurate. Can't you turn, can you? Are you a U-turner? Are you one who U-turns? You're not, okay. Honestly, I think I go up in Spadef, down in special attack. Yeah. Water compaction, lefties, I'm good with that. That I think is a solid, solid lead. Okay. What am I going to do about this Archaladon? Uh, go Tapu Lele with Aura Sphere. 67 to 80%. That one that I oh, it's got sturdier, so I can't one shot it anyway. Um, Kiratina, what are you doing these days? Kiratina, a sixty-eight. Let me go modest ability, solid rock. Actually, at Earth Power. Earth Power would be better.
Unless I go up against the Gyarados, then I would want Aura Sphere. Um... Pretty well cover our Chalodon. Gorbis could prove to be a bit of a bugger. Against this Gorbis. Gorbis, Gorbis, what do you do to Gorbis? Yeah, what about Aegislash? Do we, we Aegislash it up? he can do to me is surf. Is illusion. Can't use priority on Gorbis. I need to remember that. Okay. My teammates were straight booty. <laughs> Had to lock in. No worries, man. No problem. Hey, yo, what if I use... Fight SD. I'm going to go protect over a king shield since I don't have stance change anyway. So if I go... What are the odds I sweep with this thing? Hold on, guys. Hold on. There's no shot, right?
Am I about to just run the craziest set of my life? You have a message from the main rat himself, Mortimer E. Mouse. Yeah? Ah. Yo? That's coming up soon, huh? That's coming up real soon. Eleven more sleeps. Hell yeah, dude. I'm excited for you. That's awesome. Dude, I think I'm going to try this. Adamant. Illusion. Swords Dance Protect. Leftovers. With Toxic and Sacred Sword. That has potential to be nasty. Okay. And as a backup, uh, I do have our chalot for our chaladon. I do have Giratina, which will do really well. Um. Honestly, I think we bring Mantine here. He's really specially bulky. Kingdra. We've got Giratina as potential. Oh, do I have anyone left with Guts Hitmonlee and just acquired the Flame and Toxic Orb? True. That is true. I'll keep that in mind. That's actually a really good point. That is actually a good point. Where's my flame orb? Hey, quit barking! Flame orb. Oh, I have a bunch of flame orbs. Aqua step boost speed. Uh, yes, it does. Okay, Blaze Kick, good for Ferrothorn. Aqua Step, boost my speed. Uh, let's run Drain Punch instead of Brick Break. Where are you, Drain Punch? Oh, he can't know Drain Punch? What? Well, that sucks. Can you U-turn? 
Are you a U-Turner boy? Are you one who U-turns? You're not. Ugh! Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. can't run back. I mean, it's nice because it's priority, but Sucker Punch is also priority. My special attack is just way too low. Try to camp body press. Uh, we could maybe bring Hitmonlee, though. Wish my physical defense was a little better, but my spadef is good. The problem is... Uh, well... This Ferrothorn's gonna hit me physically. He's got iron barbs and a rocky helmet. Oh, I just thought of the perfect counter for that thing. Where is he? Right here. <sighs> Fur coat. Hisui and Typhlosion. cherry berry on him. Dude, is this too risky? If I leave the rain up. Okay, I can get rid of defog though. For protect. Come on, protect. Where are you? I don't need defog for this fight. Get para charge. Yeah, but what do I get rid of those thing? I think he gets it. Oh, maybe he doesn't. At least not yet. You know, I hope to get rid of the rain, though, fairly soon. So I think I go T-Bolt instead of Electric Shot. Yeah. 
Electric shot would be nice if I was going to leave the rain up, but I really don't want to. I still think I lead with Taco. We just need to do it, guys. I think I want Protect instead of Synthesis. On Taco. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go pee and see what the dogs are freaking out about real quick. I'll be back in a minute, and then we'll fight Misty. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, guys. The dogs are being spazzes. They saw another dog out there, so they're freaking out. Hopefully, they'll calm down. Can any mods evolve? No, everything should be fully evolved. Man, I'm just... I'm not used to doing this kind of strat where I literally... I'm used to having a strat where I literally have a safe swap in for every mon that can, like, one or two shot. I'm not used to... You know what I'm saying? I hope this works out, though. Peanut, be quiet. Man. Okay, no speed up. <laughs> Halifin should flip turn here. So I spore turn one. Does flip turn. This shouldn't do much to me. Not at all, really. Give me a spadef bust. Buff. 
defense. Plus two. I'm plus two defense. Okay, I spore you. Now I sunny day. Okay, he woke up. Dragon Pulse. Okay, let me protect. I spore again. This is where I go Aegis Slash. ASD. So the flash cannons me. Plus four. Plus six. do lose Age of Slash. That's a bit of a dagger. I need to not speed up. I knew this was a bad idea. Is he plus two or plus four? I'm in trouble.
I have to sack hit on Lee. That wasn't enough? Are you kidding? I think I lose, guys. That's it. You've got to be joking me. You've got to be joking me. I'm out of... I'm out of roost. Loose. Nope, Hitmonlee was a terrible idea. That actually sucks so bad. I knew I should have just done my thing. Done my own strat. Dragon Claw. That was stupid. <clears throat> yeah, that... And I don't mean this personal, but that's why I usually don't listen to chat's advice on these fights. That's why I normally just do my own thing and not listen to chat.
Oh, I can't use priority on him. I knew that. Dang it. <sighs> this is why I don't listen to chat. Dang it! <sighs> that is so frustrating. Well, it ended up being a cleaver she gave me with static. Ah, that's nice. What the hell? It takes so long to get back to this point. We were one fight away from our PB. it takes to get back to this point. Is anyone still here anyway? If you're in chat, say something. I'm just curious. Do we keep going? I mean, it's obviously no longer a valid Nuzlocke run, but do we keep going? Or do we just restart? Man, one fight away. Oh, one fight away from the PB. I had the Mons to beat her, too. Ah. I'm sorry. I know that I'm just complaining, and it it's... Ultimately, it's my fault. I did it. You know, I'm just, that's extremely frustrating. It just takes so long to get to this point in the game.
Always a chance to get better mons, though. Dude, my mons weren't the problem. I've got some great mons. That's not the problem. The problem was not properly preparing. get drain punch or anything probably not he doesn't does he get any punching moves thing would have been so nice to have. You know what? Let's start a new run. Man, that was our first attempt, too. And we did so good. Ugh. That bites. That bites hard. Okay, yeah, um... So, there's always been kind of a no backseat gaming rule. I did kind of let it slide a little bit in that run here and there, you know, because I get you guys are trying to help, and I, I, I do appreciate the thought of trying to help, but from here on out... No, we're just gonna say no backseat gaming, period, because... It's just... It puts me in a situation where I almost feel rushed and obligated to listen to you guys, even though I know I shouldn't. Hey, Rayra. Yeah, no, and you're good, Mike. I know that it wasn't, like... Yeah. No, I, I know that there was, you know, no... You know, no... What's the word I'm looking for? 
I knew you weren't like trying to like tell me what to do and stuff. I just, yeah, it, it's it's all good. It's not it's not your fault by any means. I'm ultimately the one playing the game. I'm the one that ultimately made the decision. You know. I need to just stick to my same strategy that I always use where I can get them on in with a safe switch in, take a hit, and get the KO. That has served me well. I need to not try and get fancy with some of these. Like like I get what you were saying with the guts hit on Lee and everything. You know, that wasn't that wasn't an inherently bad move, because that, you know, a gut tip on Lee with a flame orb, I mean that's that's great, you know. It's just I need to stick to what I know and to the play style that I'm good at, if that makes sense. Hey Angel, welcome on in, how you doing? But yeah, no worries, Mike. Like I say, I know that you were you were trying to help, and that's I, I do appreciate the thought of trying to help for sure. It just ended in a very unfortunate way. Understandable to think the guts of Monthly would do better. I'm sorry about the intermediate lose the run. Yeah, and it, and it wasn't just that. There, I mean, I I used speed up, and I know I shouldn't have. Literally, before every boss fight, I click off the screen so I can't speed up even if I want to. And that time, I was like, oh, I'll just you know be careful. But then I just get way too into it, and I do stupid stuff, and it just comes to bite me in the butt. Uh, I think we gotta go... Reggie Drago. Uh, these are named after members and people who donate, by the way. Just so you guys are aware, if you would like a Pokemon named after you. Reggie Drago. Oh man, we need to... Man, we're running low on members, guys. Y'all have been slacking, which is crazy because we literally added just a $2 membership. Like, made it way cheaper, thinking it would, like, bring people in. And just kind of... I don't know. Actually dropped off, which kind of really surprises me. Went from $5 to $2, but... All right. Okay, let's check this thing out. Download. I'll take a download, Reggie Drago. Reggie Drago. All I have is Twister and Vice Grip. Oh boy.
Luckily, the Nuzlocke doesn't count till we get our balls. Good attack and special attack. What are G Drago stats? Uh, 100 in both attacks. Pretty low in both defenses, but really good HP. He's got 200 HP, so... Potentially a very good Mon. Hey, what up, Nihility? Ability makes it base tech 150 penny and special physical boost. Yep. It is really good. I'll try to I'll try to be in a good mood, guys. I'm not worried about that, Angel. We can get unlimited money and buy as many potions as we want. But uh, let's not backseat game. Aaron Skarmory Gibble for this one. I did get the repel, didn't I? I did. Okay. Okay, again, Nuzlocke does not start till we get balls. We wanted to see what happened to Danbro. I got no doubt you can get further than Misty, though, this run. Yeah, I just... I don't know. I don't want to sound like I'm just beating a dead horse and saying the same thing over and over again. I just... I'm... Again, nothing personal at all against anybody. I do appreciate the thought of wanting to help. I really do. But I'm... Unless I agree that it's just a really, really good idea and it's something that I just absolutely had not thought of. I'm not I'm not listening to chat anymore. You know what I mean? I get that you guys want to help and I appreciate that. I just... That could have been a great run. Even after everything we had lost, we had a lot of great Pokemon.
I suggest that they make her kick that gym leader's ass. Yeah. Like I said, and I, and I do appreciate the thought. You know, the help and stuff. I just... I need to strategize in the way that I'm good at strategizing. You know what I mean? Question, if you were ever incarnated in the Pokemon world which region, would you want to be born in? Probably Kanto. I've always just... I've always loved Kanto. Kanto or Johto, probably. Okay. Daytime. Actually, let's get our rod first. The old rod. We could get a lot of yos. Oh, that's going to be so hard to catch, though. Seeing early game, we have to really be careful. Boldrod Tyrantrum would be good. Quilava is really good. Let's see what nighttime's got. Magirna. Venusaur? Oh man, I've got options here. That's a really good type. Steel and Fairy. <sighs> Do I risk the Magirna? I have no idea how hard this is going to be to catch. We got it. Let's go. Alright, I'm going to name this after Michaela. Shout out to Michaela for being a long time member on the channel. I appreciate you. That is such a good typing. Unaware. Not the best ability we could have asked for, but it's not true on our slow start. Actually, Lucky Chant could be clutch for later for Giovanni's Honchkrow. Now that I think about it. It's okay, we'll have the movie learner long before then. Okay, nighttime route 22, let's go. Yo, Zygarde! That's too risky, right? Mm. Was your route one encounter? Haven't gotten it yet. Only have the two mons so far, my starter in the Viridian City. Zygarde's really good. What does it have? If it has like Dragon Rage or something, I could be in big trouble. It's 
Zygarde's such a good mon, though. Safeguard, Sandstorm, Glare, Camouflage. That's tempting. Alakazam? Is Alakazam... He's probably got Teleport, though, huh? He is one of the first Megas you can get. Yeah, he'll teleport. I can't go after that. Curlia will teleport as well. That's a Fion, not a Manaphy. How do you evolve that? Oh wait, Fion? Why was I thinking Fion evolved into Manaphy? Never mind. Low-key Shuckle could be good. What do you mean you have Magirna if it has it? Fast Teleport? What does that have to do with it? I think we risk it and go Zygarde. Let me double check that moveset one more time. Sandstorm, Glare, Camouflage, Bite. Safeguard if it's five or higher. So I think I just lead with Magirna, so Sandstorm doesn't hit me. And I think I just roll with it. Zygarde had Dragon Rage. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I understand now. So I got plenty of balls. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Come on, chat. Manifest this. Manifest this. Need to register that, not scan. Come on. Come on, give me something in the first row here. Come on. There we go. That really sucks, chat. What's up, uh, Lockbeat Inc? Okay, route one, daytime. Yo, basket. We have a request. Oh, do we risk it though? Legendaries are so hard to catch early game. So sick though. Ah, it's only gonna have Twister and maybe Scary Face. Small cry in that one. No, that's big cry. What was he getting hit by? I don't know. I do not know on that. Oh, man, I want to go after the Rayquaza. It's a box art. Aren't box arts easier to c catch? Legendary box starts is a lot tougher. Giratina Zygarde. Well, that's not what I want to hear. I also have Solgaleo. 
Okay, let's see. Rayquaza catch rate. The catch rate of three, which is 1.6 percent. So it has a high catch rate of 45. That's a lot better. I think I have to go Solgaleo. Feramosa, though? Feramosa is a good sweeper. Uh, okay. Solgaleo, he might have teleport. Solgaleo does have teleport. Okay. So that eliminates him. Feramosa. Feramosa is a crazy sweeper. Uh, that I don't know, Nihility. I do not know. Oh, yeah, I did see that, Angel. Is the abilities randomized as well? Yes. Yes, abilities are randomized. Wait, you know what? There's a slack off right in front of me. Maybe we just get a slacking. Feramosa's got a decent catch rate. I mean, Slackoth's really good for later, and it should be easy to catch for now. Let's be honest, Slacking's basically a legendary. It's got a BST of 670. Let's go slack off. I feel like that's the safe play. It's an easy catch. It's as good as anything late game. Let's see, perfect. Um, I need another member. Ray Ray, you're a member. Would you like this slacking named after you? It is a slack it, it is a uh, female slacking. Rayla, that's not right. Why was this thing a little 13 already? And a shiny Steeny, nice! Okay, Pallet Town, Old Rod. Tyrant. Or possibly a shaman. I'm okay with that. I think we, uh, let me check night or daytime. Should be the same though. Yeah. I need to register my old rod. We do get the Shaman. Okay. It's not Skyform, but still base 100 all across the board. I get Sleep Powder at level 5. Not bad at all. And <laughs> we catch it first ball. All right. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Nihility. All right, let me write some abilities down here real quick. Uh, slack off, I'm not even going to worry about right now because that's not what its final ability is going to be. 
Shaman has weak armor. Weak armor shaman. Okay, and then this route. Daytime. Oldrod Maril or Oldrod Zeraora. The Zeraora would be beautiful. Tapu Bulu would be awesome too. Chimchar ain't bad. I think I go Tapu Bulu. What kind of catch rate does he have? Ooh, not great. Arctivish doesn't get anything good early game, huh? Yeah, not really. I think I kind of have to go Tapu Bulu. It's got slow start. It does get another ability, though. after Bry. Obviously right now it's garbage. But it does get another ability later. So maybe it'll turn out to be okay. That's the only slow start mon we get. Let's just get it out of the way now. Just get it out of the way now so we don't get any more later. Is that Primordial Sea Basket Legion? Is that what I just saw? Oh, that would have been nice. Uh, honestly. Well, I'll wait. I was going to say, I had to stick a couple of these in the PC for later, but until I have a full team, probably shouldn't do that. Okay, Route 2. Can you get a Mel Metal? And Mortar's good. Bulbasaur's good, but we got good Grass types already.
What's Mel Metal's catch rate? Not good. I think we... I'm leaning towards Magmortar. He gets three different abilities, which is good. Okay, he does get a decent learn set, too. after TJ. Shout out to TJ for being a huge supporter on the channel. Long time member. Actually the biggest supporter we've ever had. Uh, Magmortar, Unseen Fist. Contact moves, bypass, protect. Probably change that later if we get something even remotely decent. Good call, Kenzie. Hey guys, hit the like button, sub to the channel if you have not already done so. Wall rain is good. What about Dracazolt? Does he have a good early game set? I think we go wall rain. First ball, let's go. And Chris. Name's after my boy Chris. Surf is also a good choice. Eh, it's... Man. Not really getting lucky with these abilities. Honestly, other than download on Regidrago.
Okay. That is all our encounter encounters up to this point. Let the puppies out in a minute. Okay, we got an egg. Tapu Coco, Suicune. Tapu Coco would be really good for Misty. A rufflet. Uh, is this just followed by level up? No, it's level 36 in here, Angel. Does Tapu Coco have an early decent set? Yeah? I think I go Tapu Coco. First ball. That's so awesome. Uh, Hunter, we'll name this after you. Shout out to Hunter. AKA Bros and Shows. 
Oh, you're good, Angel. No worries. But yeah, no, it's level 36. It's not the 50s. At least in this game. Fur coat Tapu Coco. Yo. That's really good. Fur coat, Tapu Coco. Are you ready to go out? Okay, hang on. I don't know why that dog has to scream when he yawns. Okay, I'm gonna let the dogs out. Oh, give me just a minute, guys. I will be right back.
Oh, those dogs are a pain in the butt. Sorry about that, guys. Crazy dogs. Thank you for 15 likes on the stream, though. Alright, we got Falconer, and then Brock. Yo, Thonk Raid! What's up, your local cat girl? How you doing? Welcome in. Thank you for the raid, guys. What were you guys up to today? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Worked on Halo, playing through every campaign. Nice, that sounds fun. Heck yeah. Loki horrible and I'm excited to be past it. I never really got into much Halo, if I'm being honest with you. Nothing against it, I just... I don't know, never did a lot with it. Miracle Seed, that's what I was trying to give. Okay. Not really gonna bother calking for Falconer. To be honest with you. Shouldn't need to. Hey, yo. All right. There we go. We got it. We got him. Yeah, it's been a long time since I've played a Halo game. Is it raining at home? No, but it's windy. No rain yet. Start with this stupid Geo dude.
My team's not super well equipped for Brock, if I'm being honest with you. But we're gonna try and make it work. Never touched Halo, but I used to be a beast at COD. I've played a very limited amount of COD, honestly, too. If to say honestly, if I'm being honest with you. Okay, speed up off. No speed up allowed. Okay, raise my special attack. I think I just twister frame one. Stupid sturdy. He does bulldoze. She lowers my speed. I bet I'm still faster, though. Yeah, I should still outspeed him. That's what a Custop Berry is? I thought it protected him from ground moves. Oh, that's scary. I don't like that at all. Like, even a little bit. Uh, okay, I think I... This thing has lower attack than the Geodude did, so I should be okay to just twist her here. I'm at 38, go down to 23. This is where I swap. <clears throat> I just have to go to Nihility here. We're good. Whew. Rock tomb. Get slack off evolved. Sucker punch. Yeah. Vessel of Ruin Vigoroth. That's actually a usable mon. I still want to keep it alive until it's fully evolved, but it's it's usable now.
All right. <clears throat> Let's keep schmoving. How long have we been live? Almost four hours. Okay. Still got a little bit of time. Okay, night time right here. Oh, yo, it's Aptos. Blissy. Blissy's so good. Blissy's broken in this game. We've got some good options here. I think we have to go Blissy, though. Yes. All right. Um. Don't have any other mm, female members to name this after. I'll name this after Kins. Shout out to Kinsey. One of the most broken mons in the game. Technician. Okay. Yeah, Blissey's like really good in Rad Red. What does Bestow do? Oh, yeah. That's a Zekrom. Oh boy. Oh dear. Okay, let's get our static. No way we catch this. There's just no way. Right, there's no way. Surely there's no way. There was no way. Yep, didn't think so. Dang it. Okay, let's get our magic carps. Really?
Oh, that sucks. Um. We can fully evolve them now, though. I did not mean to delete Aqua Jet. I'm really glad we have a move relearner coming up. Sandrush. Could... I was going to say, could be a Giovanni Mon. Probably not. No. No, probably not. This thing's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Oh my hell, will my phone stop vibrating? Oh my gosh. Okay. What are our daytime encounters here? Alakazam? He be. Ooh. Brizian? Is Dusk... Does Alakazam still have teleport? He may not. Actually, yeah, he will. It's not going to be that high a level yet. Um... Dusknor is bulky as sin. Gets some of the elemental punches. Actually, all of the elemental punches. And Shadow Sneak. And Will O Wisp. About Verizian. Wait, is that. Yeah, okay, it is actual Verizian. got such a low catch rate. Ah, oh, it'd be so nice to have, but... I'm thinking maybe Gyarados. Gyarados or Dusknor?
Gyarados has Intrepid Sword. Yes. Oh, that's awesome, Gyarados with Intrepid Sword. Dragon Dance Zacian. Yeah, pretty much. I was like, wait, what are you talking about? Yeah, I gotcha. Okay, so he's nothing too special right now with his moveset. But later on, that's going to be a really good mon. When does he get D-Dance? Gyarados. Learn Dragon Dance at level 73? <sighs> really? Not till 73? Oi, oi, oi. Hey, caramba. Hey, Dios mío. Alright, Mount Moon encounter. Nighttime. We could have another shot at Zygarde. Or Necrozma. Yo! Dude, these catch rates are awful. You know what? I do have sleep powder now, though. I think we go after Zygarde again. Oh, no. Yes! We got it. That's huge. That is 
astronomically huge for later game. Oh, what up, Hunter? Good timing. Uh, I did already name one after Hunter, but, you know, you're a member on two channels, so I think Hockey is a pretty sick name for Zygarde. So, welcome to the squad, Hockey. Aroma Veil. Does he get another... No, he does not get another ability. That kind of sucks. It's not horrible. It's not a negative ability. It's just not great. Zygarde. Still just a really good mon all around. Man, just a just a good Pokemon. Sweet. Just gotta avoid those ice types. How does this thing evolve? 26. Really good team so far. Yeah. Yeah, we're, uh, we've got some power for sure. I think getting that Blissey is going to prove to be huge for us. Blissey is just so good in this game against special attackers. You know what I just realized? In that last run, there were several legendaries I could have gone and gotten statics because I had Rock Smash. Sir, you're a Rayquaza. Sir, you're a dead Rayquaza. Frogadier. Like Frogadad. Got him. Okay, we've got our first double battle, ladies and gents. We got a Hisuian Voltorb and a Thwacky. Ah. Uh. Mm. Eh. Lead with this, I guess. Okay, first things first, Aurora Beam, the Voltorb, and then I Quake Attack the Voltorb. Never mind, no I don't. Oh, we eat that. Okay, now I Aurora Beam Thwacky, and I Quake Attack the Voltorb. Now, I, no, I, 
Aurora Beam Thwacky. I Electro Web those guys. Easy. Easiest battle of my career. Okay, we got a g g g g g limit up next. With a speed stat of 35. So I have speed. Scorching Sands. Honestly, I might be able to just keep TJ in and just win. Yeah, I think I just need to win. That's all I need to do. Berry should to still take it out. It does. Okay. This should be Mighty Anna. It is Mighty Anna. Honestly, I just flame burst for the stab. I get out of here because I'm stupid. Yay, we win. And now, our team cap, or our level cap, is 57. 27. Why did I just say 57? I don't know. Eh, we no confuse. We no confuse. Body slam. Mirror shot. Yo. That stab. Heal Tyler of his confusion. I'm not confused. What am I confused about? What's up, Bri? Let's start leveling up the squad. I thought I said that we no confuse. I don't know. I don't know things. Body slam. Okay, Swallow, are you worth having? <sighs> Not particularly. I have a swarming Swallow. How goes it? Oh, it goes. It'd be going better if I hadn't listened to chat in my last run through and we wouldn't have lost, you know. But it's what I get for listening to chat. Might be a while before Zygarde's real good, but that's okay. We no cry. We no cry. Did 
Dude, we got such a good team, though. We've got some momentum. Low quick, uh, low kick. I wish it was power up punch. That'd be neat. You know, like it used to be for the stupid update. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, great! Thanks for the, thanks for the pie dev. Real grateful for it. Strength will evolve. Twenty eight. Ah, we're one level away. Golly dang. Okay, yeah, this is the same route. That's right. Get an egg, shall we? Shall we egg it up? We're egging, we're egging. A snom for a carnivine. I don't want either of those Pokemon. Unless it was a Sevian carnivine. Which, honestly, it might be. The Sevian Carnivine actually isn't bad. Pretty cool typing. Relatively unique typing. <sighs> Clefairy. It doesn't learn anything to level 51 when it gets Moonblast. That's kind of stinky. I need to keep it a Clefairy for a while, I guess. Striker. It was supposed to be the mascot, yeah. Not that I love Pikachu much more. But, you know. Okay, let's get this out of the way. I lead with... Bunny Right? Fake out. D punch.
I'm earthquaking. I'm ice sharding. Yo, Fletchling. I brave bird. I brave bird. Go back to Baneri. I fake out. I healing wish. Oof. Brave bird. My brave bird. Actually, where are my attacks like? Special is still better. Okay, so. Brave Bird Tapu Coco, huh? Okay, we've got our rival fight coming up. And our rival took the Bulbasaur. Pretty sure. Okay, so... Honestly, I think I just lead with Magirna with Mirror Shot. Bring Warring for Staravia. Coco for Star Avia.
What did he just do? What? Dude, that defiant messed me up. Wow. 07's for TJ. Dang, man. Been live for almost four and a half hours. Okay, next is a single battle.
I really need to get a good fighting type. This is a token encounter. 
species clause. Okay, now I'll use my token encounter. Honestly, I'm just gonna go after the Rayquaza again. Shaking. Come on. Come on, Rayquaza, please. Guys, my soul is weary.
I can't switch out. Come on, please give me something good here. Please. Straight across. Okay. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Come on now. Dang it, dude. That's four mons in a row I haven't been able to catch. My team is not exactly equipped for Bugsy at the moment. Um, man. I think I go fight Misty first. Because of that.
It's probably going to be flip turn right off the bat. No, grass knot. Okay, Misty down. Comatose is actually sick for this thing because of uh, Chuck's Breloom. That's actually awesome. Counters before fighting Bugsy. Oh, 
Oh, wait. We have a Team Rocket grunt we gotta fight. Oops. Um... I really don't have much of anything for this Persian. We should be okay though.
Oh, it's going, Chris. It'd be a lot better if I hadn't listened to chat. I should have just done my thing, you know? But it's okay. It's, it goes. We're still hanging out playing Radical Red, so it's a good time. Ooh, Galarian Zapdos. That's really good. If I could catch it. That's oh, regular Avalug. Does he get... Pretty good. Hmm. But Galarian Zapdos, though. Yeah, we're still hanging in there, Mike. Base catch rate of 0.3%. Oh, no. Hmm. How do I risk it? thing is, if I get it, that's a really good mon. Like, a really good mon. Avalug can actually be really good too, though, and would be significantly easier to catch. I do need a good fighting type, though. Some ultra balls now. Okay. Thunder wave.
Come on. Come on. I don't know what he did to gain health, but that's fine. Come on, Zapdos. You're shaking. I can see the ball shaking. I knew it. I knew it. I knew I shouldn't have risked it, and I did it anyway. I knew it, and I risked it anyway. Alright, what do we have here for daytime? Tapu Fini? We're just gonna collect all the tapus. The life scores good. I would love a Zara Aura, but oh, hey Dragon. Hey Dragon could be good. score contrary gly score I think it'd be good for Surge. Potentially. You're way too low level. What are you doing? What am I doing? Well, Golden goes good later. Much, much, much later. <clears throat>
Removes added effects to boost damage by 30%. Does that mean... That... I don't get my stats lowered by, um... Oh, hell. What's that move called? Um... Make it rain. Well, I'll get Shadow Ball at 35. That's not bad. Recover at 42. Okay, I'm going to leave him in the PC for now. Hopip, really? Hopip. Well, I can fully evolve it, I guess. a dose shield on archin tortuga tyrant oh i got a giratina Giratina has Grassy Surge. Okay. Still not getting that fire type I want.
How does Pan Cham level up or evolve? Is it just level up? At level 32 with a dark type in the party. Do I have a dark type? I don't think I've gotten a dark type. Okay, well we can't evolve Pancham right now. Shield on should be like level 30, right? Yep. Cow Compulse Earth Ring, not bad. Not bad at all. I'll take that. Clink. How does Clink evolve? Clink evolves into Clang at level 38. And then Clang into Clink Clang at 49. Okay, wow. That's kind of shizzy. Emolga with Hustle. I'm so glad we got another Giratina. That makes me happy. Get an old or good rod. Old rod Beldum. Good rod Impidimp. Ooh. I think I go for the Impidimp just because it's easy to catch. 
If that were Metagross, and it'd have the same catch rate, I would go for that. But Impidimp... Yeah, I think I go Impidimp. Okay, good rod. Speed boost Morgrim. Too bad that's not uh, fully evolved. That'd be sick. Nighttime. Cleaver is really good. Cleaver is really, really good. Oh, so is Rush Ram. I think I gotta go Cleaver, though. Why is this thing so hard to catch, dude? Got it. Self-sufficient cleaver, okay. That's really good. Fire water moves Max's speed. Dude, this thing's good. This thing's really good.
I'm so lucky I caught that. I need to go buy balls right now. Grassy Surge. I still really could use a fire type. We go good right here. Amanda Buzz, I'm actually okay with that. I'm good with Amanda Buzz. Blazing Soul, does he get any fire moves? Hey, what up, Drew? How you doing? Stick with Blazing Soul for now. She probably doesn't get any, any fighting moves or any fire moves, right? Like at all. That's a cool ability, just not for him. He gets Heat Wave for some reason. I guess he's a vulture. They live in the desert, you know. Pretty meh ability, but Manda Buzz is actually not a bad mon. Just vibing? Heck yeah, dude. Heck yeah, dude. Thanks for 16 likes on the stream, guys. Uh, I think... <clears throat> I think we have to be done stalling. I think we have to just go fight Bugsy. Enough pussyfooting around. Oh, he gets Bone Rush? What?
don't know why he gets Rock Tomb, but I'm okay with it. Okay, let's beat Bugsy. Let's go Thraddling. Actually, isn't that the Flame Charge TM right down here? Why did I just do that? Changed it to Thunder Punch, that's right. Okay, he goes low kicks right off the bat. I'm just gonna stone axe. Knocks off my citrus. That really sucks. It's a really crappy thing you just did. Oh, 
Ledian comes in. Should eat this fairly well. Giratina, I guess. Well, I've been live for five and about a half hours, and chat is dead silent, so I think we're going to wrap up.